The name Bobby Fischer may not mean much today, but 40 years ago, he was one of the most famous people in the world. This American chess player's victory over the Soviet champion Boris Spassky in Reykjavik, Iceland, at the time of the Cold War, was a historic event. Fischer was probably the greatest player of all time, but his unconventional upbringing and the pressures of success proved too much. Shortly after becoming world champion in 1972, he disappeared and gradually descended into paranoia and madness. He died in 2008 at the age of 64. His disturbing story is the subject of a remarkable documentary, Bobby Fischer Against the World. It features a vast range of footage, including an American television interview with Fischer when he was a young man at the height of his powers. This is how it went. Bobby, uh, you've given virtually your entire life to the world of chess. What about Bobby Fischer, the man? What's he like? <laughs> I don't know, it's pretty, uh, uh, chess and me, you know, it's like, it's hard to take them apart, you know. Chess like my alter ego, you know. I don't need to, you know, it's... But there are times when you get away from that chess board. What do you do? I don't do too much at the most. See, I'm really, you know, tied up in chess. I intend to expand, but first I gotta get the title. It's basically... You're from Brooklyn originally. Chicago, well, born in Chicago. I moved to Brooklyn when I was about six. I lived on the coast. Lived in... Were you playing chess by then? Well, I learned in uh, New York, yeah. I, uh, what age? Six. When did you start to get serious about chess? Oh, well, I was maybe seven. <laughs> Is your mother still living? Yeah. Do you get a chance to see her very much? I haven't seen her in a few years, yeah. So. What about your father? No, I don't see him. Uh... Did, are they living together? No, her, her. Bobby, uh, you've been playing this game since you were six years old and playing it very seriously shortly after the age of six. Did all this concentration to the exclusion of other activities, did, did, did this bother you? Do you think this deprived you of anything growing up? Maybe, yeah, yeah, to some extent, yeah. Like what? Well, it would have been better, you know, a little more balanced, yeah. Maybe, you know, a little more rounded, you know, but what can you do? 